So we started in February where we had a pilot on Bremer Ward, which is an elderly medical ward. And what we did was involve the patients, the relatives and the staff alike to get patients up and dressed by lunchtime so they could sit out for their meals. And we made a lunch club as well. So what we found was a really positive impact on patients a, for their loneliness, so they were more involved in lots of social activities, which means they feel less vulnerable leaving hospital. And more than that, they were up and home a lot quicker than we'd expect for an elderly patient with an infection. And it was really positive for families to believe their relative was going to go home and to have that real positive impact of an admission rather than focusing on being poorly. And having patients up and about, what effect does that have on the hospital as a whole? So what we find is it does help um, reduce the impact of equipment that needs post-discharge, so we don't have to pay for as much to go into the home because patients are as independent as they were prior to coming in or have stayed at their normal level. Um, we find they don't need as much care because, again, they haven't lost their ability to get themselves washed and dressed or to manage in the kitchen, which means patients can stick as themselves. They can have the life they had prior to coming in rather than going home with people coming into their home or needing help. We had a 98-year-old lady who came in. She had a heart attack and was resuscitated in our A&E department. She came to the ward. She was up on the first day walking around, came to the lunch club, and then she was telling off her relatives for not bringing in her best skirt because she wouldn't find a boyfriend if there wasn't her best skirt in. And she left after three days. And for someone who's 98 years old to go home with no care, no equipment, and quite that fast was really, really impressive. It's hard to say exactly what caused it, but patients now, they come in and they focus on the fact that they're poorly. And so they have that mentality of staying in bed and letting themselves recover when actually what we need to do is encourage them to keep at everything they can do. If you were at home, you wouldn't eat every meal in bed and stay there all day. You'd get up and do even something little just to maintain your strength and your ability. And that's what we think is really important to get back now and capture back in the NHS.